You know a drug dealer named Rondell Robinson? No. You're squinting. You don't know him? I know who he is. I meant I don't know him personally. So if I had a witness that saw you and Vic acting real friendly with Rondell Robinson, that would be a lie. That's right. So that witness didn't see the three of you at a car wash? Well, Vic was just putting a scare into him. Letting him, letting him know that we were we were watching him. So you lied about that? Then? No, I didn't lie about that. I, I meant something else. You. Terry knew that you and Vic were in bed with Rondell no. Robinson, so Terry had to die. Terry was a part of our team. You didn't trust him. He was your errand you boy. No, this is bullshit. You let Terry into that house to die. No, not true. The one guy who disapproved of Vic and Rondell is the only team member who didn't come out of that house alive? That's a coincidence? Want. Believe what you want. Terry was going to turn you in, so Vic wanted him dead. No. Vic needed him dead! No! The shot. That's what the last shot was. The last shot? Two times girlfriend says in her statement that she heard the last shot 10, 15 seconds after the others. When we approached two times, he moved. Vic couldn't leave it to chance. Vic fired once more. That's the shot that killed Terry. No. Vic fired that shot, didn't he? No. Stop squinting! I know. You're wrong. I want Mackie. You don't have to go down with him. That is not how it happened. Stop lying to me. I know what happened. I have a witness, Shane. He connects you and Vic with Rondell Robinson. I have a witness. Give me Vic and your problems end. Just give me. What's going on here? You've had him here for two hours? He's making up sick shit about us, Vic. Go downstairs, wait for me. This whole thing is a joke. Grab a sandwich, Dutch boy. I know what you did. Up until now, I've tolerated you. You come near my men again. I don't lose patience. You listening? I know.